This is the kind of game you dream about when you're a kid, for sure. Uh, for a game to, uh, to to end like it did with them scoring the equalizer, for us to go into overtime, uh, to go down a goal and then come back, equalize, you know, in the you know, dying minutes of the extra time, and then for it to go, you know, up the entire, you know, starting eleven uh, for for the PK shootout with, you know, the way we dodged about a hundred bullets, it, it was incredible. Now, you were saying over the weekend that this team responds well to pressure uh, when your backs are against the wall. Tonight really attests to that more than anything. Yeah, absolutely. You know, and, and I have to tip my, my hat to, to Kansas City. I mean, uh, Peter Vermees has done such a great job with uh, that group of players, and uh, you know they they really believe in each other. They showed a lot of ca character to come back, and um, Nemeth's a great player. You know, he scored an unbelievable goal against us, a classy finish. Uh, so you know, definitely have to uh, uh, tip my cap to those guys. And you guys obviously have a quick turnaround. Vancouver coming here. Um, coach said a few minutes ago, you guys, you're not you're not satisfied with just this. Talk to me about the next step. Yeah, I think the, there's no doubt in my mind that this, this group is capable of making a, a deep run in these playoffs, and, and this town is just so hungry for a title. Um, you, know, you could just feel it uh, in the crowd tonight, and you know we were just uh, we just felt like the crowd just had our backs. The, the Timbers Army were back there and just cheering for us, and they you know they gave us that special energy we needed to to get those PKs. Thank you. Thanks. Now, tell me what was going through your mind when you saw that ball go off both posts. Yeah, I mean, I almost fainted. There's no doubt about that. Uh, I, I, you know, I've never, you know, been through an experience like that with, with PKs going all the way to, to the goalkeeper. And, and for us, like I said, we dodged, you know, 100 bullets there, you know, with, with uh, them having chances to, to win the game. You know, Adam keeping us in it. You know, it was a roller coaster. What were you saying to the players around you, you know, in the 87th minute when... Casey, you know, ties it up, yeah. looking like it might go an extra time. What were you guys saying in, in the in the huddle? Yeah, you know, we just got to keep going. There, there's there's going to be situations like that. You know, I thought we 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 had the best uh, the best of the play, the the run of play um, over the course of the 90 minutes. You know, they they scored a you know a great goal. You know, a, a testament to their character. And you know, we had a battle through extra time. We go down a goal, and then you know, a test of our character. We came back. Maxi, great finish. Um, I just think there's a special energy about this group right now. Uh, for sure, we're all playing for each other, and, and we're excited for this next step. And not just a test mentally, but even physically. Very, very contentious fighting game. Yeah. What does this do for you guys moving into Vancouver? Oh, yeah, you know, and we're obviously going to be playing against a team that is very physical in Vancouver, and, and uh, you know, they've proven that they can, um, they can be just as successful as anybody in this league. Um, I'm sure they're they're excited for this matchup as much as we are. Awesome. Thanks, man. Good luck. You're just on short rest. You're on shortest rest. How do you guys recuperate and get ready? Yeah, I mean, it starts tonight. You know, I, I I can't imagine I'll be sleeping too well tonight. I'm gonna do my best, but um, you know, massage tables, nutrition, um, you know, anything we can do to get ready for Sunday. And you know, um, we're gonna be on adrenaline for sure on Sunday. Um, but the good thing is, we play Sunday. We we hopefully get a result, and then we got a whole week to to rest up and, and get ready for the next one. Does it make a difference shooting those PKs toward the Timbers Army? Absolutely. I mean, those guys uh, just just give you uh, such a great energy, uh, such a great feeling. You know, they they have our backs through you know the wins and the losses, and you know I was I was really excited to go down and take my PK in front of those guys. Adam talked about how he studied. Uh, you know, uh, rarely for sure. Uh, you know, we, we shot him yesterday, and, and I think Caleb had a, a good feel for you know who was confident and, and where you know where he wanted to put put guys in the lineup. And I'm glad that, that you know they they put us where we, where where were they put us because um, you know it, it takes the, the guesswork out of you know when you're going to go. You got to step up and just take care of your PK.